the Discovery Channel has decided to basically get rid of Ted Nugent's no. uh, gun-related show. It's Ted Nugent's Gun Country. There are some conflicting reports on this. So Ted Nugent was basically going around town telling people this was going to be a series. It was going to be a regular show. The Discovery Channel says, no, it was just a one-hour special. We never planned on making this a series. But nonetheless, they've decided they... Yeah, well, they're, they're not telling the truth. I mean, you do a one-hour special, your hope is that it's going to be a series. Right. Mm -hmm. Okay, that's well, interesting. Well, you know, the other part is that Ted Nugent is not known for his veracity. So yeah. Yeah. the truth could be somewhere in the middle, no, but, but, I, mean, I, but I don't sure. doubt what I mean, you're if it, saying. If it was huge and successful, I'm sure they would have done a series. And they're, right. they're, they're getting, I'm, yeah, I don't, I don't, right, I to say they're not quite saying they're lying, they're out is, it's not, we thought we, we thought we might do it, and now we think we might not. Yeah, and by the way, that happens all the time. It's not like, they're, yeah. oh, they're picking on Ted Nugent. You do a one-hour series. If it does gangbusters, as Ben said, you make something else out of it. If right. it doesn't do gangbusters, well, you did a one-hour series. What was the name now, of the show? Uh, Ted Nugent's Gun Country. Well, gun, it's interesting, Gun Country, because obviously the country he's talking about can't be the United States of America, because he very clearly said that if Barack Obama wins, he's done with America. So I guess gun country is some other country. Yeah, it yeah. should be. Get, yeah, uh, yeah, Ted, I assume you're doing the show out of Canada, right? No, you're not going to Canada. They got mm. there worse. You know, he's well, got to go, go somewhere where there's freedom. Somalia. Right. Somalia, right? Okay, you can. I uh, Vanguard did a series on this. Yeah. You can go to an open market in Somalia. No registration, no nothing. You just go buy assault weapons in the middle of the market. Okay, as long as you got enough money. Ted, uh, Somalia's got your name written all over it. And by the way, this guy, of course, is not a patriot to begin with. Uh, when we had a war uh, like Vietnam and he finally had his chance to fire guns, of course, he ran like a coward. He literally crapped himself for a week to get out of Vietnam. That's a story that Ted Nugent wrote about. So uh, this guy with his fake bravado, and the minute he had an opportunity to actually exercise it, he literally crapped himself. Literally, yeah, it's <laughs> yeah. amazing. Um, anyway, his show had, uh, the Nielsen rating indicated that his show had a viewership of about 864,000 people in all. It's not, it's not that bad. Which yeah, they say that it was bad, but I, I'm, Mike, that's not that bad for Discovery. Depending on the time and yeah. what it is, that's not bad at all. Right, um. and uh, so to be fair, right? Uh, now, is Discovery unhappy with the publicity that Ted Nugent got to during the election? You betcha. Okay, so that might have had something to do with whether they decided to, con to do a series or not. Yeah. And so Nugent's probably butthurt over that, or he might be butthurt over all the shit that's left over in his ass from crapping himself. Really? Ha, 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 ha.